Hello and welcome to another episode of Half Hour Backlog, a game where I play unplayed games. What? A game where I play? A show where I play unplayed games from my Steam library 30 minutes at a time and try not to get tongue tied. Today I am playing Deus Ex Invisible War, the sequel to 2000's Deus Ex, released in 2003 by Ion Storm and Eidos Interactive and added to my Steam library in January 2011. Uh, this game was initially made for consoles, I believe, and wow, this sensitivity is insane. Um, I played it back on the Xbox and absolutely loved it. I absolutely fell in love with the aesthetic of it, and it seems everyone else uh, prefers the original Deus Ex, but uh, I guess I'm uh, just a little bit different. Um... Yeah, I love the color palette. I love all the, the holographic stuff that they got going on. Uh, I'm looking for sensitivity. This game, you'll see from the menu later on, it was clearly made for controllers. So I'm trying to use that. But it, I guess at this time, Xbox controllers didn't work on PCs. So, maybe I won't be playing on controller. Because, you know, it's sticking this cursor in the middle of my screen and stuff. How do I go to inventory? Yeah. So there's a lot of, like, this menu on the, the right side here. Uh, if I can figure out how to use any of my menus. Okay, okay. Controller is not going to work. Oh, no. Alright, alright. Scratch that idea. Everything's like very blocky and made to go up and down on controllers. Or maybe pointed joystick in a direction. I see that you're awake. Just trying to sleep off the chopper ride. What happened? The Let me introduce myself. Layla Nassif, director of the Tonsus Academy. I've been moved to Seattle. What about Billy? Is she here too? Alex, I'm afraid something happened in Chicago. A terrorist attack. Oh no! We There's a terrorist attack in Chicago. You told me anything about an attack. You don't want all the details in one dose, trust me. Why don't you come downstairs to meet the other trainee and refer to the map you found at the facility? Billy Adams, you know from Chicago. What was that noise? Nothing to be concerned about. <coughs> Your assignment. <laughs> Explosion. Don't worry about it. Uh, okay. Is this still, this is still my apartment. Uh, yeah, I love, like, this holographic keypad. It's a little too holographic, honestly, but... It's just everything's this, like, glass with a mesh fence on it. Everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. <clears throat> 454... These little spider bots that go in the vents. Um, I love it. And let's see if I can make some progress in this. Oh, that guy's dead. Janitor has nothing interesting to say. I can buy some snacks. This is 452. Not interested. Ooh, credits. Uh, can I go in there? No. 454. Hey! Oh god. Yeah, who's there? It's me. Fine. Until our security assessment changes. Billy! Oh, you are wide. Any idea what's going on around? I tried to get answers out of Dr. Nasif, but all she'd give me is the elevator code. It's two. That pose is insane. If you need it. I don't know what's going on. 28901. No time to talk. We're under attack. Can I have your stuff? I'm sure you've all yeah. You've all there were an I'll let you know if the elevator will last open until the top of the hour. Two eight nine oh one. He didn't even come down. Yeah, sometimes explosions happen. Get over it. Oh. Apparently I didn't need that keypad. Uh uh huh. Apparently it's going to do that every time. Okay, but we're back. 
Compass tutorial. Wow. Okay, can't go in there yet. Oh, hello. This won't be a repeat of Chicago. The facility, no one, just an isolated incident. Listen, we want the trainees to stay in the record. Doctor, doctor, we have a code yellow. Uh, hello, Stan. Are you sure? Just a bit of a code yellow. You'd better introduce yourself to the others. What's going on? I have a right to know if I'm in danger. You'll be safe in the wreck area. Go out. There are explosions going on, and they're just like, it's fine. You'll be fine. Hello there. You must be Alex. Hi, Clara. Hi. Probably just more demolition. That's Upper Seattle. My foster parents. Your parents? Oh. Hello. Just more demolition. I'm sure. Leo Jankowski. You're looking at Leo Jankowski. Train here now. Alex, I just talked to Dr. Ms. Would I be running if there was an emergency? Right, Jankowski. It's great to finally meet Well, don't be intimidated by my rank. Thanks. I appreciate that. Probably staged. The test for the new transfers. Of course. I wrote the exercises because of my performance. I'll let you get back to your run. And just jumped out. <laughs> well, whoa, <laughs> the physics on this basketball are insane. I think I can get it in, though. Okay, no time. Soda. Please report to A17. I bet it is a drill, some kind of test. Okay, okay. Uh, uh oh. They'll be watching to see how we handle it. Wait, where am I supposed to go? I hope it's nothing serious. Dr. Nassi, please report to A17. Oh, there's something down here. Whoa! Who's yawning? I heard someone yawn. Loot the lockers. Uh, this one's locked. Yeah, yeah. Oh, baton and a pistol. In an unlocked locker. Thank you. Okay, so this one seems to have a grenade and is that a cred stick? I think so. This one has I think ammo and an energy recharge. Oh, those are cigarettes. Useless. Actually, that might actually be useful in this game. I don't remember. Vice added to inventory. I was trying to loot the garbage can and I just uh, picked the whole thing up. We've got trouble. I spotted a seeker coming our way. Look, there's no reason for me to drag a trainee into a firefight. Why don't you try? Sounds like a not if you're careful. Just stick to the. Sh uh. Okay. I'll get out without. Good luck. Bottles. Crouch with C. What was that sound? Uh... Um. Oh, I thought this was the the secret escape. Uh oh. Well, now I'm scared because I don't know where that guy went. He didn't even drop any ammo for me or anything. This is not a drill. I repeat, this is not a drill. Intruders are storming the facility. Evacuate immediately. Warning, autonomous security systems have been compromised. Julie, what are you doing? Forget that. How do you know they won't just cut us loose, given all this trouble at their facilities? But how? The facility's being locked down in a vacuum. Go back to your apartment. You'll be able to get to the Biomod Lab through a breach the order made in the residential area. Okay. Wait, do you know what's going on? The 
reporter contacted me in Chicago and told me how to uncover Tarsus's treachery. Oh. The trainees were test subjects. Finding out I've been used like that, I don't feel so But where does the order fit into all of this? I thought they were a world church, not private investors. The order believes in natural balance, and they see Tarsus's operations as a violation of that. It's impossible Fair -ish. to realize that your actions are secretly manipulated. I think Tarsus, among other things, works on like um, bio modification, um, cybernetics, you know, all the stuff that makes you a superhero. But they've been testing on us against our knowledge. Yeah, I've got your back. Sure, I've got your back. I've got auto aim on, so hopefully it doesn't. Sorry. Maybe I'm gonna turn off auto aim because <laughs> I think it just automatically targeted my ally. Uh, which is not ideal. Hear us. You have been brainwashed. Reject Tarsus and the tyrants who established it. Ooh, we have been brainwashed. Order be praised. May her holiness watch over and guide you. Uh, do I not have a flashlight yet? Lots of throwing bodies around. Actually, I wonder. Is there... Do I have my ooh binoculars? Okay, that can be used in the darkness. Each be interviewed individually in the near future to determine your interests and how they position you within the company. Please keep in mind how important security has become. We are looking for assurances that moving you into these new positions is the right thing. Concussion proxmine, okay. Just a lockpick sitting in the vent. Another lockpick sitting on the table. Man, Clara, what are you up to? Can I get in here? Can. Just crouch and jump the normal way you climb into something. Where's that? EMP grenade. My inventory's full. Uh, V? I can get rid of this second pistol. Um, have I taken a hit? What does this do? Harmful to your health. Okay, I'm just gonna drop it. And get an EMP grenade instead. A knife? Yeah, let's just go lethal. Uh, keep the baton for now until it's no longer useful. No, where am I? I'm lost. Is this the elevator? Or is that the elevator? What? Oh no, I am so turned around. Oh, it's you again. Yes, it's me. Pistol. Is this my own? Oh, you just used... I thought that you had to input key codes in this game. But what? Which one is it? D zero three. I didn't get a chance to read the file. Maybe we should what? not with a security grid malfunctioning. We're fine right here. Oh shit. Oh also while Deus X went crazy with like different ammo types and each weapon had a bunch of different ammo types you could swap between. Uh, this game just has a one ammo pack that you slot in and it's like nanites or something that just automatically form to the weapon you're using. Or something like that. So it's just like one generic ammo thing and different weapons use up different amounts of it. And I think as you increase your ability with different weapons, or maybe it's... You put mods on them, um, and they just get more ammo efficient. We are now in control of this facility. You've already seen the lab, so I guess it won't hurt anything for you to install a few bio mods. 
Yeah, give me those bio mods. Seminar on my biomod architecture. The Tarsus program may be unconventional, but trust me, we take care of our training. The people attacking Tarsus, are they the ones responsible for Chicago? What's going on? The Order is an intolerant cult. They hate multinational corporations and the private security forces that protect them. Well, <laughs> so they're also a multinational. Why should I trust? Okay, the important thing is biomods. Oh, I do have a flashlight. Cannot be upgraded. Um, what do I have to scroll down? Oh no, okay. I biomod. Uh, regeneration? What? Vision enhancement or spy drone, which you, of course, eject through your eyes. Cloak, hazard drone, or neural interface. Neural interface? To hack security computers. Um, I am into that. Hazard drone, which provides protection from radiation, biotoxins, and other environmental hazards. It's a drone? Black market canister required. Huh. Oops. Uh, skeletal biomod. Aggressive defense drill and thermal masking for electrostatic discard discharge. So bot domination is also a black market one. Huh. Okay, give me carrying capacity. Move silence, speed enhancement, speed enhancement. I'm still holding out for the uh, neural interface on the cranial mod. Um, vision enhancement? Regeneration seems really good. I still have no idea why that's in the eye. Um, uh, yeah, vision mod. Sure. Okay, it is the F keys. Sounds easy enough. I'm not willing to take that risk, but you guys are trained for that. Okay, have it your way. I I don't know what Idos' status right is. What? I don't know what Idos' status is right now. Uh, they're Square Enix now, right? I'm kind of holding out hope that they will make another Deus Ex game that sort of modernizes this aesthetic. I'm not super hopeful about it. Oh. Okay, do I just run? I'm just gonna run. Easy mode. So I can't hack at all until I get that neuro mod, right? Oh, I can use a multi-tool. Okay. So that's the same as in Deus Ex 1. I, I've got to play the uh, the newer games again. Well, I'll skip the first one. What, what is it? Deus Ex Human Revolution and Deus Ex, yeah, terrorists. Is this entire bio modification is more involved than you might imagine, Ali. This facility was for your protection. You know my Mankind Divided? Is that the second one? My code is going to be the second reboot one? 
Oh, but yeah, like the nanite augmentation is something that really blew my mind. What? Did someone just get blasted? Oh, shit. Uh, don't run down there. Or do. Oh! So, I did not protect the scientists. I didn't... Huh. Whoops. <laughs> uh, huh. Okay. Explosive crate. Um, uh oh. Can I just drop that? <laughs> um, I'm afraid to put it down. Okay. I was worried it might throw it. There. There's the black mod canister. Give it to me. Give it to me. Uh, do I need a key? Do a quick scan of the area before I just. It's an energy cell. My inventory full again. God damn. Um, put down the baton. Could probably put down the binoculars, but those seem, I don't know, decent. Okay, ammo. Just sitting around. Uh, there's stuff about JC Dent in here. Right, JC and Paul. Oh, they're still around. Great. So, spoiler from the first one. Uh, JC Denton played a major role in resolving the Great Death Plague. However, some suspect that he also initiated the collapse. Um, okay, so probably multiple endings from the first game. I remember at the end of this one, too, there's like a bunch of different uh, final missions that you can do. So depending on your choices, it gives you a completely different area to go to. No, wait, is that true? Maybe it all takes you to New York and you just go to different parts of it to resolve things differently. Um, but that also blew my mind at the time. It's like, holy crap, you can choose who you're going to side with. You can kill the guys that would be your friends in another playthrough. What? How am I doing for time here? I got seven minutes left. Um, and I got my illegal biomod, so now I can become a hacker. So level one enables to uh, hack security computers to control cameras, no energy cost. Hopefully I'll find a computer and I can actually give that a shot. Oh hey! Love a med drone. And I don't know what an EMP barrel is, but they exist. Oh no, that's a gas barrel. Oops, oops, that's bad. Also, no reloads in this game. Um, you just have your. Oh, I hear a spider drone. Oh shit, ow, ow. Hacking, hacking. It's not going to do me any good. Security camera on. Security camera control. Turret. Hostile. Um, friendly? Oh. I can't even turn it off. But I can turn the camera off. And I can release the spider pod if I wanted. Oh shit! 
I... huh. I thought that I was... I thought the turret was linked to just the camera. Um... So there's a cute little spider bot, and he comes out if I guess... I guess if I triggered the camera, he would come out? I still can't pick that up, even though I specifically got the upgrade for it. Hmm. Hmm. Could use my EMP grenade, I suppose. No use holding on to it. Who are you? I'm Oh. Hi. We can't protect you in Upper Seattle. You will have to come to our church. Protect me from who? Dr. Nuss, no one forced me into the covert. That's because you never tried to leave. Believe me, you would have been killed the second you let down those scientists. The only killers I've seen so far are your- I apologize. My overzealous captain disappeared. You can't control your own- The church suffers from certain- Yeah, yeah, there's different people as part of the organization. That's typical. Alex still hasn't learned that yet. And of course, this game takes place in Seattle. Classic cyberpunk location. I don't know why that became the case. I think they go to Seattle in um, Blade Runners in Seattle. I think, what is it? Not Neuromancer, the one before that. Oh no, it is Neuromancer. Snow Crash is the second one. On? I, I think in Neuromancer that they go to Seattle at some point pretty quickly. Just answer my questions. Who do you work for? That's one of them. I don't know why. Sure? Was Seattle the city of the future at some point? Okay, you can pass, but you're in. Is something wrong? Just move along so we can seal off the area. You'll be safe in the depth. Now it's just coffee. Look at what WTO is. Is it the World Trade Organization? You're not gonna fight me, are you? No. Ooh. Those guys look like bad news. Okay, so I can break into Dr. Nassif's apartment. There's like these news terminals. They call themselves the Knights Templar and claim to be descended from Chu the Pan and the Temple of Solomon. Great, so now I'm dealing with Templars. There's a lot going on. There's full on aliens. Keep your hands to yourself. I guess business is a little slow because could be. Business is all yeah, I wouldn't have to pull too much. Just curious. There are competing coffee chains. Personally, I think it's about time Laura Seattle kicked away coffee in particular. I hear you. Have something specific. It's not that I want to see anyone get hurt. But I'd pay to see someone break in and set fire to their inventory of coffee beans. <laughs> nice. That's arson. Very perceptive. <laughs> you look like one of those curses. I'd have to think. The Queequeg's manager lives in apartment 21 of the Herring's Loft building. I bet you could find the code to the shop there. Careful, though. He's always loafing around at home. Get out of Upper Seattle while you can. The WTO could decide to Okay, so where's Queequeg's? Can I find Queequeg's? Coffee shop? The other coffee shop? What? This is where I just left. Alright. Well, I suppose this is about where we're going to end up leaving it. Um, maybe I'll see if I can find those punks and see if they want to chat. Oh, hi! Order. Mar spoke to me when you entered the Enclave. That's no excuse. The Order seeks peace. You're not going to get past the specific threat. threat detected. Are you going to eliminate the threat or what, robot? Oh, robot, you suck. Thank you. 